Allison here with Osborne Books and More, and this is my youngest daughter, Aubrey, who is six, and she's gonna show off a few of her favorite books really quickly. Um, this is, um, it's like, they're masks. So it's Little Red Riding Hood. It's a hardback book, but it's a retelling of the story, so it's kind of a so fun, fractured like, fairy, fairy yeah. tale. And so there can be like someone, we need to act out with this play. Like, there can be someone with Little Red Riding Hood. I'm gonna put my hair. And, or there could be a wolf. Wolf, wolf, wolf. And the fun thing about it is it's a funny version of the story. Um, it tells you when to, to hold up which mask when it's that person in the story. Oh, Mom, um, that's We it. added popsicle sticks. It says you can do string, but to be able to do it quickly, we thought the popsicle sticks were good. No, Mama, this is cool. Look, your mouth is kind of like your teeth yes. are in your mouth. And, and there's a talk. Goldilocks version as yeah, well. I want to so. show, show them. The we can't, we don't have time, maybe. Okay. okay, what else? So, wait, first readers. These are the first readers. So this is a big, huge set. My first reading library. This was one of my favorites, first favorites. When she was first learning to read, um, I had the set that only included eight of these books. And this was the first one. And I wanted to just show you really quickly as you're teaching a child to read, these are great because it has just certain letter sounds that they have to know, like the T, the A, and the P sound. I would read this portion and then she would sound out phonetically and read that part. And she felt so confident by the end of the book because there were just certain words and certain letters she had to know. And then it would build. So the first eight... And I think this is a new one. Yes, this didn't come in her, her original set, but it is in this big set. And this is actually the best deal. You get 50 books. That's a um, lot. And so that's a good one to have on hand when you're trying to teach one to read. All right, show them your next one. Busy Bug Book. I almost said busy bugs on okay. the go. Our busy books? Um, there's something that we, um, it was hard for us. Like, we, you have to have it on a flat surface. Okay, and you can want, you can pull back on it yeah, and it and will yeah, go along the track. Yeah, it, it, you don't even have to move it along so it just goes. And there's some stuff to be read on the pages too, some things to look I for. I know I'm reading it. And, um, this is but, a longer one. It's a lot of fun for kids, hands-on. There are also wind-up versions as well. Another set of books that she likes. Tell them about these real quick. Little Sticker Dolly Dressing. I have more than this. Yeah, these are just some of hers, but these are smaller um, sticker books. Yeah, I have like a ballerina, a fairy, um, a princess, a Christmas, a puppies, and a mermaid. And I have more. And they're just lots of fun. You build And um, I girl. only have one big one. That's a unicorn one. But these have been her favorite. That's why she has the whole collection. And she's going to end with this one. Not right now. You choose in space. There is a normal you choose and there's just a matching. But um, you choose. The normal one, we don't know where it is. It's her favorite. Um, this one asks open-ended questions. Aww, and we should have had that other one because they should have I know. And then you can um, let the child choose whatever it yeah, is that like, they would like. Yeah, it's like which one's like normal for you and which one's not. And it's just a lot of fun. They can choose their clothes and so. And it, on the clothes one in normal you choose, there's um, that guy. He's sticking out his booty. <laughs> so, <funny. laughs> anyway, those are some of Aubrey's favorites, so thanks for watching.